when we get a patient's report many things are mentioned in it like sperm morphology motility so in many patients reports it is also written as a dead sperm count now what is dead sperm count let's understand it first dead sperm count happens when the morphology or shape of sperm is defected the sperm is not moving or it is not alive how does a sperm move if we see the sperm through a microscope sperm movement is like this they are swimming but actually they are not swimming they are moving in a spinning motion with the help of their tail the tail keeps rotating which gives sperm the energy to move in the forward direction under the microscope if a sperm does not show such a spiral spinning movement then the sperm is declared as dead sperm now why is the sperm dead let's know about it there are many different reasons for dead sperm count the patient who come to us with the reports out of them 10% are those who do a lot of gym do heavy weight lifting or some such strength activities we generally see that their dead sperm count is a little high and their morphology is on the bad side there is a reason behind it the reason behind it is that the protein we eat in our diet is taken up mostly by our muscles for repair the regeneration when they're doing heavy weight lifting exercise the muscle mass gets ruptured in the gym so what does it recover from it recovers from the protein we give to our body and when muscles takes up protein from your body to recover then there gets protein shortage at some other places like in ayurveda it is said that the seventh stage your sperm is formed the seventh stage is the last stage now to reach that stage there should be enough protein in your body to reach that can give you healthy sperm because of this there comes the problems now another part related to this that if you are suffering from in digestion your stomach is upset you are suffering from loose motion or after eating food habits you have to go to motions then also this scenario is created that the chances of dead sperm count is increasing there apart from this if you have problem like colitis ibs liver problems then you are sperm count can be dead too this was about how sperm get dead now how to treat dead sperm count because all these things are related to death of sperm count that means we should focus on treating the actual reason of dead sperm count the way to treat this is very easy if you are suffering from ibs or uh, suffering from colitis then i will give you the name of two supplements if you want to recover from them then it is fine otherwise there are different brands name for this supplementation you can take them also but first of all you write the name of two supplementation for vitamin d arachidol nan drops and the another one is methylcobalamin for b12 there are many different names of brands selling this salts before buying you need to see methylcobalamin salt in whichever brand you get there should be b12 proportion in it understand that b12 and vitamin d is a requirement for your protein and is the necessary for healthy sperm production also you need to start taking more protein eat more eggs your sperm count is dead because there is not enough egg protein don't try to take protein supplement for this some patients ask if they can take whey protein so don't take whey protein because whey protein is just a protein it needs carbs to be digested in your body it doesn't work it will make your motions tight or will cause loose motion so you should not take protein like this you will take it in the form of egg or a soya products like tofu so here protein methylcobalamin salt and vitamin d these three things can make your dead sperm count to alive otherwise if you have done all these things and uh, after that you are not getting the results of the healthy sperm count then you can meet any physician around you 
and if you don't get any answer then you can call us on the number given below you can talk to my team and you can get right solution for that till then take care see you in the next video then bye bye